So today we're going to be solving another problem from the MIT integration, but this time from the 2020 MIT qualifier test for the integration bit itself. And so we're supposed to integrate 1 over x minus 1 plus this beautiful quotient of two power series in terms of n and x that's gonna be all with respect to x so how do i want to solve this problem well first of all i'd like to make this integral become two integrals let's do something like that i would like to disconnect it and draw another integral sign that looks awful something like this and so now i'd like to first of all calculate this guy on the left and then move on to the heavyweight stuff on the right hand side so first of all what is this highlighted in yellow integral well we know how to calculate this integral oh man it's awful the integral of 1 over x minus 1 dx i mean just set your u equal to x minus 1 you will get your du equal to your dx and there are no bounds of integration to check and so you will just get an integral i'm bad at running integrals an integral of 1 over u du which is just the natural log of the absolute value of u plus a constant but now just kind of well reminding ourselves that oh man yeah we did a u sub there we will get the natural log of and now the x minus one which was our u and then plus our constant and so we get our beautiful answer right over here i'm just gonna drag and drop it like there oh now it's better and now what is the answer for the second integral we've got right here highlighted in i don't know let's maybe say orange that was better yeah so let's first of all maybe try and examine what those power series even are in the first place so let's first of all try and kind of examine the first power series which is the sum as n goes from 0 to 2019 of x to the power of n well the first oh rather all of these terms are gonna be 1 plus x plus x squared is gonna be just continuing until we hit x to the power of 2019 is gonna be the entire power series but now i have to show you guys a pretty interesting trick right there if i were to first of all move this stuff a little bit to the um, right i guess and then differentiate both sides of this equation both sides of this equation with respect to x what will i get well i will get now first of all the derivative of this one right there this is just going to be a zero so i'm gonna get a zero then the derivative of x is just a one then the derivative of x squared is gonna be just double dx and then x cubed is gonna be three times x squared and so on and so forth until i get to the derivative of 2000 of x to the 2019 which is 2019 x to the power of 2018 but well now if i were to just use sigma notation in order to kind of write this thing what would i end up with just the sum as n goes from 0 up to 2019 of n multiplied by x to the power of n minus 1 but now i can just pretty much shift the indexes here and now i'm gonna get the sum as n goes from 0 to 2018 of n plus 1 times x to the power of n but this thing well this is just the exact same stuff that we had right there and so actually this bit with those power series here we're just kind of dividing the derivative of some kind of a function by the function itself so maybe a u sub <laughs> I, i'm just gonna kind of make a little bit more space here and now i'd like to make myself a u sub of u being equal to the sum as n goes from 0 to 2019 of x to the power of n then my du is gonna be equal to the sum as n goes from 0 to 2018 of n plus 1 multiplied by x and it's gonna be all dx well there are no bounds of integration so that's gonna be the kind of the entire use up honestly and now i'd like to just plug what i got here 
into my integral at hand and so what I'm gonna get after applying this thing is gonna be the integral of pretty much just du divided by a u and this thing is nothing but just the natural log of the absolute value of u plus some of the constant and so we'll get that this thing is gonna be just the natural log of the absolute value of d sum as n goes from 0 up to 2019 of x to the power of n all mm, in the absolute value then all plus a c but now well we can pretty much just go on and pretty nicely yeah, simplify this expression right there using the formula that gives us the sum of a geometric series of a finite uh, of a finite bro yeah, a finite geometric series yeah so what we're gonna get is going to be the natural log of the absolute value of x to the power of 20 20 minus 1 all divided all divided by x minus 1 and then plus a constant and so what we'll actually get after combining this result that we've got there with this result that i'm gonna slide over right here so everybody knows that this thing corresponds to this stuff and this result corresponds to that stuff and so what we're gonna get is well now we can just go on and nicely uh, sum everything up right here and so we will get the natural log of x minus 1 plus the natural log of x to the power of 20 20 minus 1 all over x minus 1 all over x minus 1 in the absolute value and then plus a c but now we can just kind of use the laws governing the standard exponents but logarithms in order to rewrite this natural log of x to the 20 20 minus 1 over x minus 1 as the natural log of the absolute value of x to the 20 20 minus 1 and then minus the natural log of x minus 1 and then well, when we do it, we'll get the natural log of the absolute value of x minus 1 plus the natural log of the absolute value of x to the power of 20, 20, and then minus 1, and then minus the natural log of x minus 1, and then plus a constant. But those two natural, log of, natural logs of x minus 1, those are going to cancel each other out, and what we're going to be left with in the very end is going to be just the natural log of x to the power of 20, 20, minus 1, plus a constant, and the... Oh, bro. And this is exactly the antiderivative. We were looking for this problem, and so we will get that this awfully looking integral that I split half into integrals is going to evaluate to just the natural log of x to the 2020 minus 1 plus a constant. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and see you in the next one. Bye.